Josh. We're, uh, we're down here on the corner of 8th and Chestnut in what is now called the West Village. Mm. I guess what they're trying to have it be called. The West Village. We'll leave you guys to debate the merits of something like that. It's artsy. As you can see, it's very artsy. We have some of these beautiful signs here, beautiful artwork out here. Alimentary <laughs> is where we are today. Kind of a new place, Italian joint. They've got pizza on the menu. Um, we're gonna check it out. Caleb, do you know what that name means? I have no clue. Okay. I have absolutely no. My guess is elementary, maybe bare essentials in, in Italian or something like that. No clue. Ooh, Let's get a look at this okay. pizza. We got a, this is about a, they, av they said about a 10 inch pizza. One size, they have one size. Four slices. Yeah. Um, we got some big peps, some of the biggest peps we've seen nice yet. Looking yeah, nice looking peps. Yeah. Nice looking peps. It kind of has, it kind of has a little bit of a, um, like, ball game yeah. look to it. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, almost something you get from the snack bar Just at, like, at, at a major league game though. Yes, major, major league, league game. Yes, and a uh, lot of cheese. Looks really good and cheesy. I and like then the way it looks. Also some uh, Parmesan some sprinkled Parmesan. on top. It's pre-Parmesan. Yeah. I like that. A little bit of grease. Yeah, let's get a feel for the slice here. Ooh, kind okay. of a soft. Yeah, Ooh, that's a, soft. That's you, very soft. It looks like it's going to be harder, but it is very soft. Very soft. Uh, which, which we'll see. Very we'll see. cheesy. All right, we'll face it and place it. You know we do. Face bibs it on. and place it. Bibs on. Face and place it. Oh, hot. Oh my god, I'm burning my mouth. You alright? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> This thing is fresh out of the oven. Mm -hmm. Fresh out of the oven. Kale, were you okay? Mm -hmm. Did you burn your taste buds mm. on? You know, I had breakfast this morning. I love so it. So I could, um, so I could, uh, you know, I could, I could judge it properly because I realized that a starving man you can't really trust when it comes to mm. issues of flavor and taste. No offense to starving people or anything, but um, so we got a lot of cheese going on here. It feels extremely cheesy. It's almost a mix between dough and cheese. Yeah. You know, I mean, we're coming on a really, really, really heavy, very soft. It's hard to. Hard for me to even be able to talk about the sauce. Um, good amount of grease and oil in it. Pepperoni taste. I like Pe those pepperonis. Yeah, the pepperonis are good. Let me I get like a little them. nibble of just. I the like pepperoni. the sauce. I think we have some really fresh sauce underneath there, mm -hmm. but it, fe it, it 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 it's covered up. It's kind of concealed a little bit. Yeah. By by the by the the, the cheese. All in all, though, fresh fresh ingredients. Very fresh. It feels fresh. I don't know about this hold though. If you were let it cool a little bit, maybe you're down here with your fam, you won't have to jump in it, right? Like Caleb and I, we got, we got high level uh, creative executive jobs, so we don't have all the, all the time in the world down here. That is true. Yeah, the, it's a, it's a, I would say it's straight up a little too soft. I mean, a little floppy. A little floppy. No. Yeah, a little bready. Mm -hmm. Not that crisp, there's no crisp here. I'm missing a little crisp in my crust. Yep, it's, the ingredients are good though, it's like a, it's just, Good standard sliced pizza tastes good, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna I'm, I'm not gonna you know throw my bra on it. You nothing, know? I mean, nothing special. Nothing special. Um, which fair enough. They're an Italian joint. I think pizza's sort of a side thing on the menu. It kind of looks like a special kind of place. Though. It is very fancy, very nice. Um, All right, Caleb, what do you think? I'm gonna give it a. Uh, I'm gonna give this a 6.0. It is, you know, mm -hmm. it's above mm -hmm. average. It's it's good, but sure. like they did everything right. I don't know if they, I don't know if they are pizza lovers. And like Johnny's saying, it's not really a pizza place, but they do have a full spread on the it's menu. A little, of pizza. little bit, just sort of a of a of a, yeah. a really doughy kind of soft mixture of elements there, mixed ingredients. I'm gonna put this today. I like where you're at. I think six out is nice. It's definitely not on a five range. I think we're above that. Yeah, here. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna go above you just a little bit. I'm gonna do six two. Good. I'm gonna do six two today. I six think it's just, I think I think a six zero oh and a six two is a solid score. Puts it at a six one, which we'll, we'll average it at a six one. Which, I, I stand by that. Good. And you've got you've got it's Pinkberry right up the street here. Have you been to Pinkberry? Mm -mm. Froyo spot. Mm. Yeah, they've got a non dairy coconut. Blow your horns off. That's awesome. There you go. All right, what that's up, it. Man? Chattanooga Pizza Review.